All right, it's time now for Great Day Fitness. Burn fat, improve your mood, and reduce your pain in a holistic way. Doctor, I'm calling you the doctor. He's the doctor of fat loss. <laughs> Joe Carabasi is here, and Joe is launching a new treatment. It's called contrast therapy, and it can really help us lose weight and boost our energy and our overall health. Yeah, it's honestly absolute game changer. And so literally, like all things, so first of all, cold therapy, cold exposure, which by the way, I'm not somebody who loves the cold. Yeah, I'm not either. But I will tell you this. You, first of all, you get better, obviously, with more exposure, but it is so beneficial in how you feel, in your mood, in your circulation, because it oxygenizes you, it increases circulation, it reduces soreness. It also includes, increases recovery. So whether you're training really hard or you get a lot of stress going on in your life, but I think the two most important things for anybody listening, why they'd want to do cold exposure, which would be it increases your ability to burn brown fat or activate brown fat. Brown fat burns fat and increases your metabolism. And the other thing about brown fat is it activates mitochondria and, and mitochondria is energy. And so we lack energy and sometimes more coffee, well, a lot of times more coffee is not the answer. Mm -hmm. So getting energy from within, from your own body cells, is an absolute game changer. Well, how do you propose we get this cold therapy? Yeah, how do you do cold therapy? I mean, I've seen you laying <laughs> I've in seen the snow. Some ideas, yeah. But that's not what you're proposing that we do at Define Wellness. No, no, no. So I'll, I'll go in the snow, I'll go in the ocean in the cold, but look, that's not idea for most people. So you can do cold showers at home, and I do recommend it. Cold showers, I think, are actually harder than cold plunging because you're just getting this like constant spray of of water yeah, on you, exactly. whereas a cold plunge you can kind of relax into. So we go over breathing protocols for people, but basically you, you hop into our cold plunge and we teach you how to breathe in a way that is going to increase your parasympathetic nervous system. So a lot of times when people, when we do things that are like really, really cold, like, <gasps> right, that's our sympathetic nervous state. Well, and that's kind of the state that we're in most of the day, it's just exaggerated, or our fight or flight, which creates a lot of stress, which by the way, fight or flight decreases metabolism, fight or flight, decreases digestion, elimination, and even reproduction. So getting your body into more parasympathetic is going to help with all of those things. But when you're getting into a cold plunge, we go over a protocol that you need. And basically, you can start with 30 seconds at the higher end of the degrees, right? And then we do increments. So you're not going to stay in for, you know, an extended period of time. What is it? Is it water? Is it air? Is it's it water. Wa it's water. Yeah. Okay. It's water. We got some motivational videos you can watch while you're in it. There's a nice TV, really cool atmosphere. And, and I'm telling you, when you get out, you just How feel cold amazing. How is it? Well, it? Well, you can go from 50 degrees down to 38. But start, we would start with 50 degrees for 30 seconds. And by the way, we can put booties on your feet. So our, our hands, our feet, and our head are super, super, super sensitive yeah. to extremes hot and cold. So when we cover those areas, you can better focus on getting the cold exposure to the bulk of your body where you can get the greatest amount of benefit. So okay. if we do this right, it's, you say contrast therapy. So yeah. are we supposed to do the sauna and the pod first and then the cold? Is that the point? Or so no, you just do the cold? The most amount of studies will show you do cold, hot, cold. Uh -huh. So start with cold and uncold. However, I'm all a believer of practicality and what fits for you. And so we have, so it's easier to go from hot to cold. And so when you're starting off, we recommend using our pod or our sauna, do your session, then do your cold exposure. Okay. How, do we just Scott's get looking at me like you're out of your mind. Well, I'm just like, I, I just don't <laughs> like the cold so much, and the thought of like 30 seconds of cold is terrifying. I me. hear you, but you know what? That's another important thing, and I think, our, I think our world now more than ever needs this, is that there's a mental empowerment and benefit to this as well. It's going to stimulate your positive hormones, but it's also going to build your resilience. Yeah. And so often we put we, we, we don't understand the capabilities we have. And I, I, I guarantee you. What do I have to come to? What, am I wearing a bathing suit when I show up? What am yes, I wearing? a bathing suit. I mean, you could wear a wetsuit, but no, you'd want to wear a bathing suit. Okay. You don't have to wear it Is there. It you can change it. Is it private or with other people? Yeah. So we have private cold plunges because I, I, you know, look, it, it, it is a nice to kind of have your own area yeah. when you're doing this because you want to go at your own pace. You don't want to feel pressure from other people. And there's no expectation. It's just to do your best. And what I can tell you this is that when you start just a little bit, you're going to feel so good and so much more empowered. It'll become easier the next time. And before you know it, it's routine. Yeah. Hey, we can try anything mm -hmm. once. And Great Day Connecticut <laughs> viewers are getting half off your first 
plunge or contrast therapy session. Um, all you have to do is call or text 860-916-0252. You can also visit, visit excuse me, definewellnesscenter.com.